me to focus on my needs for a bit. My brother works as a cop in this town, but I haven't seen him since the outbreak. We could definitely use more people with tactical training. See what you can find. <sighs> All right, guys, what is good? We are back now in our new Update 25 lethal walkthrough, this time in Providence Ridge. Originally, we did start off in Mayor Valley, but eh. We can always try uh, have a new, uh, what do you call it, change of scenery. Alright, so last time we left off, yes, we still have the gym going up, another four minutes and change, latrine's good, morale is, I guess, acceptable. What do we have? That is for, oh, yes, that's correct. Alright, cool. So we're alright, we're alright. Now, last time we left off, I believe we also had those uh, mechanics, uh, those same people that have that really scary power-on mission. So I know we're saving up our explosives for that one. We still don't have a, any nighttime survivors yet. In fact, there's nobody with full wits. Whoops, no, we're not ready for that just yet. No one with full wits yet, actually. Wow. And Homegirl still needs her cardio. But she's still healing up. Yeah, this one's in the best condition, so she's definitely up. We're going to see if we can get her wits up, actually. Alright, running water would improve the base. Yeah, that actually might be kind of true, but I think we can survive for now. Uh, food is at minus four. That's right, we do have a food outpost. We have gains in materials every day, so we're not worried about that one. And to upgrade you, would take another 800 influence, which we don't quite have yet. I guess we can do the whole boys in blue thing, right? Oh my gosh, that is far! Oh man, that's a lot of gas. That's a lot of gas, and it's not like I can go down there and... Oh, oh, now now it's you guys. Okay, so I guess we'll have to go there first. Give them the fuel that we're probably going to need for ourselves. Then go down here to look for your goddamn brother, and then maybe circle back home. Um, We have got a lot to do. Two gas cans? We might even have to take an extra one just to be, like, absolutely certain. At least we have a repair kit. And we can possibly even stop by those people. Um, I don't know, for anything, really. Let's see, how's our gas looking? Yeah, we can take one more, because we're going to have to do a lot of driving. We're going to have to do it really quickly, too. In fact, let me see. Find resources, because I don't want to take anything off the map, all right? It's bad enough that um, everything's in a plague territory. Let's see, where is it? Where is it? Oh, perfect. So close to home. I like that. Probably going to be right in that gas station, too. Hopefully it doesn't actually deplete from um, the resources on the map. At least I'm pretty sure it doesn't. Because I have found things in places that have been completely searched out, but after starting that little radio prompt, all of a sudden, there's one more item you can find in that searched out place. Well, I'm not liking the music. It sounds like like I'm being like surrounded slowly or something. Not bad. There it is. Right, we'll keep that in the trunk. We'll go and get off the gas thing, man. Alright, keep this in the trunk. We'll go and visit those guys. Look at that. The last thing we can actually put in there. Um, since we already got the fuel, well, I mean, we might as well just go and pay a visit to those guys. Maybe they got something else for us that we can keep. I know they had Molotovs last time. Not quite sure what else. But man, yeah, I really love having these guys around. Oh, wow, and they even had a rucksack right there. Not that I want to, like, you know, keep buying stuff. We'll definitely take the Molotovs, guys. Thanks a lot. All right, all right, all right. First stop, you guys. You know what? We can also be, uh, visit the Bounty Broker. We're going to need to get our hands on a 50 caliber weapon. At least one person should always have that. And we don't have anything in our... In our uh, weapons lockup. Nothing substantial anyway. So yeah, someone's got to have something big. Plus with that power on mission that's going to be coming up soon. I want to be as prepared as I can because I know how bad things can go in that mission. Alright, alright. Here we are. Here we are. You guys that are chilling right next to two plague hearts. Alright, let's just get the... Oh. Alright, I guess you guys wanted to steal my kill. I like that. I really don't. I forgot your fuel. Yeah, your fuel. 
that you guys just for some reason couldn't find yourself, but I mean, you're in a really bad spot, so I don't blame you if you really don't even want to go outside. Alright, there you go. Remnants, what do you guys have for us? Okay, we've gone down to influence a considerable amount. Alright, you guys got bombs. You got bombs. And Molotovs. Bombs are more valuable. 150? Uh, let's do it. We'll just do it. Okay. Next. Bounty Broker. Hopefully he's got a 50 cal in there somewhere that we can, uh, we can use. And even if he does, who knows, he might not even be able to afford it because we're just, you know, crapping out our freaking influence now on bombs and stuff. Alright, nice suit, dude. What's up? What do we got? What do we got? We got this thing that... Yeah, it's not a bad weapon. Cool, we'll just... Oh, we got influence for it, too. Oh, that's awesome. 700. Damn. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Come on. You've got to have a 50 cal in here somewhere. Maybe one that I've even gotten previously. What's this one? Kill one bloater with explosives? I can do that. We can use the influence right now. Wow, all this ish is kind of expensive, and it's... Damn it. 975. I should have seen that one coming. A sniper would also be nice to have. We don't have to have it now, though. Make 10 cups of coffee. That's a lot of food, man. Jeez, this thing actually just might be a waste of space. Provides water to the facility. I don't think water really does anything to help this thing out. Plus 25 fighting experience rate. Ah, okay, no, it's not worth it. I don't need to lose food and meds. Food and meds? For one thing? No, I'm good. I'll just switch you out. Yeah, shows you how much I really use the fighting gym. Shooting range is going to cost us ammo, and I don't want to really lose out on that. Um, yeah, no, that's not necessary. For the time being... There's a latrine. For the time being, it's just going to remain empty for now, I guess. There's nothing else we can do. Scavenging for fuel. Wait, still scavenging for fuel? Aw, oh, nuts. So there was supposed to be two then. Didn't even take that in. Yeah, we're just uh, clearly just making a bunch of blunders. We're going to go and deal with the boys in blue thing, because I'm not going to circle back just for a rucksack of fuel. Whatever. I guess this is what I'm really not... Oh, wow. An open... Uh... Look at that. Okay. Look at that. A spot that's actually not taken by, you know, plague territory. That's interesting. I wonder how many more spots there are like that. Maybe I could create an outpost down there or close by or something. I don't know. All right, cool. You. Come and get it. And on our way back, we'll go get our influence. Okay, here we are. Here we are. Check out the duty roster to see where he was last assigned. Okay. Uh, we don't need to be carrying this really, really heavy weapon. Look out, a feral. Oh, seriously. No idea where you saw him? Oh, but he found me. That's great. Come and get it. Why are you walking towards me like that? That was weird. See, the thing is, I still kind of refuse to use the dodge command on Ferals. Um, even though that whole, like, um, what do you call it, impact detection thing has been fixed with Ferals, I still actually just prefer not to dodge. It uses way less stamina. Okay, that crowd's getting kind of close. Yeah, we're gonna have to, like, take care of him, you know, any time now. I need some more stamina stuff because we're not going to be able to fight all these guys, that's for damn sure. Oh, this is supposed to be a nice, quiet operation, guys. Damn. Alright, alright, alright. Almost forgot about what? What are you talking about? You guys are confusing sometimes, man. Oh boy. Yeah, it already sounds like there's a fair enough, like, just waiting in here. I can hear him. Yeah. 
jeez. Alright, alright, let's just, uh, mosey on about here. I can still hear them breathing. I'm not sure where exactly they are. Does it even matter if I look at all the rooms? I'm not even really sure if it does. I just don't want any Zeds just literally spawning right on top of me. Oh, Jesus! Oh, jeez, am I gonna be able to make that? That much I don't know now, actually. Especially with all the noise I'm about to start creating. Okay. Alright, here we go. Come on, come on, hon. Show no fear, sweetheart. Ah, oh, come on. Interesting mechanic, I must say. It's quite a game changer. Okay. Yeah, I know, it really does suck. Alright, let's see. Where are we going to search, man? We might even end up being able to take some good stuff from here. Highly doubt we're going to find a 50 cal, though. Okay, maybe it's like in one of those weird, tall, standing containers. Oh, never mind. I thought that was it. Alright, if we're efficient enough, we can actually get back home and deal with that zombie threat. Get a good amount of influence for it, too. Ooh, flashbangs. like seeing that. Where can this thing possibly be? Am I, like, looking in the right spots? Filing cabinet? Maybe it'll be in here instead, because I don't want to, like, search up all this stuff and be teased by what I can take and what I can't. Ah, <sighs> bullets. We don't need those right now. We'll definitely have to come back to this spot and actually loot this stuff. Uh, this had bullets, which I guess we could still take home. That should be nice. Alright, you, we've already searched... Oh, the desk. Oh, man. Leave me alone, man. I'm actually getting a little bit annoyed with you guys. Don't worry, sweetheart, we'll live. We already searched that, searched the desk. I don't want to search quickly because I don't need to attract any more attention. But damn, this process is just taking forever. I'd say this was a sign. There you are, jeez. Man. Come on, come on. Drop something already. Uh, I don't care. Drop the pain meds for now. Get that. Good. Get rid of that. We'll have to come back to this spot, that's for damn sure. I don't really need those painkillers. I don't care much for them. What I do want, though, is the ammo rucksack and the heavy weapon. There. In the bookcase. Pretty sure that stuff is not going to be remembered on the floor, but whatever. We're getting out of here. Go, 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 go sweetheart. Alright, I'm not sure what the fastest route home is, but, uh... Um, yeah, there is no fast way home. There's no way we're making it home in, in probably what's four minutes now. We would have to end up creating an outpost, switching characters, that's an option actually, that is an option. It's going to cost us something though. When we pass by that bullet place, we'll see how much time we have. Is that an actual gas station we can use? No, it's not. That would have been nice, actually. How much time do we actually have on that bad boy? Three minutes? I don't know. It's kind of ballsy, man. I don't know if we can make it in three minutes. Ah, eh, screw it. Let's just do it. We'll have to stop and fill up at some point, though. Minute 55. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I should have selected the mission so I can at least see the time on the side, but too late for that now. 
Yep, this is my turn. Goody. Yeah, these roads in Providence Ridge, man, they are just ridiculous. You are, like, far from everything at the same time, wherever you are. Unless you find yourself in a little town or something, then you're good. But then the next town's like a lifetime away. God forbid you should ever be trapped out on these roads with blood plague or something. That would be a really shitty place to be. Okay, is that our outpost? That means we're close. I don't know how much time we have. Really hoping we can make it, though. Come on, sweetheart, go. Okay, okay, get out the car. Run inside, please. All right, we made it. Oh, man. That was a bit much. That was a bit much. Put those away, put that away, and that away. I'm not sure if anybody has an automatic weapon, but I'll have to give something to someone. Yeah, yay for me. Uh, someone's got to hold this thing. Where's the next person? I have no idea where you guys are. Are you both up? Wait, where are you? Oh, you're still in bed. Sweetheart, you gotta get up. There you go, you take that. Yeah, you gotta get out of bed. Honestly, you really gotta get out of bed. Oh, shoot. hear them. Oh, jeez, I didn't even realize there was a door there. Hey, look at us. We're alive. All right, cool. There we go. Very nice influence. Scavenging for fuel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sacrifices, sacrifices. All right, guys, good hustle. Oh, jeez. Yeah, doors can be a really interesting tool against Zeds, man. You know, you stand by a door for a hot second, let them congregate, um, and then just open the door. You can get some of them on the ground. Or you can just run right through the door, which also helps. But I mean, it can also hit you right in the face, too, so, you know, it can work against you as well. Alright, your weapon's breaking, so we're going to replace you now with the other heavy weapon we just found, or one of them anyway. There we go. Uh, we can go and upgrade our food outpost. We can even go take care of that infestation too before it gets bigger. Yeah, let's go upgrade the food outpost actually. We'll just get that out of the way now. How's our materials actually? Is it too much? Ooh, materials are very, very high. Let's not lose them. Let's go use them. Oh, now she's getting tired. We better not fight a horde, man. Oh, and it's going to be daytime soon. I don't know how long it actually takes to upgrade one of these things. Hopefully a minute or so. So that way it doesn't, like, you know, totally murk our food. Uh, open outpost. Let's upgrade you. One minute. You're on. In fact, you know what? We could. I mean, we could. We could search it up. We don't have to. We don't have to. Uh, you're tired. Infestation? No, we're not going to risk that. There could be a feral over there or something. So we did see some open pockets. We can check out this little plaza. There might actually be a spot we can set up an outpost there, which would be very nice. And there was also a bullet spot. You. That one's also not a bad spot to aim for. This side is completely barren. Uh, we have allies that are close to home. Nobody else. Where do we find the remnants, actually? Okay, they're in that. They're in the mist. Never mind. And plus, you know, our landmark, which we will 
hopefully get at some point once we're strong enough to start taking on hearts no problem. Okay, okay. We still got to get our 50 cal. We are another 600 uh, influence points away from it. We have our thing from the bounty bro uh, broker we can get. There it is. Upgraded to level 2. What does that mean for us now? I think that's 3 food now? I'm not sure. Not Ooh. Plus 4 a day. That's beautiful. Okay, so it actually costs influence. Interesting. Any friendly folks out there want to come over and give me a hand? Yeah, we'll, we'll be with you in a hot second. Learn gardening. Minus one labor for 16 minutes. Gain or improve gardening skill. Okay, well, that's cool. Plus four. Wait, does that mean... Oh, we're at minus two now. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. And to upgrade again... Knowledge of gardening. Oh, yeah, lichenology. That's right. 2,000. 2,000. To triple the baseline outpost value. Yeah, that would be nice, actually. That would be good. That would be really good. For now, though, we'll take you home, because, you know, you're tired and stuff. <laughs> and we'll try to bring out homegirl that doesn't even have cardio down. Maybe she'll um, be able to get it. Alright, let's get that 50 cal already. I don't like not having one. Alright, minus two food. Not bad. We're okay. I'm not saying I'm gonna cut someone, but I'm not not saying it either. Okay. This isn't good. Okay. So this is uh this is great. We'll switch to you now. Wait, we know the friends we can get. Later. Wait, what's going on here? Why can't I just switch to you? What's going on? What's this? If these people are really uh, cranking up vehicles for us, we should... Oh. Okay, yes, I agree. Yeah. Okay, great. Now can we switch to you? Okay, awesome. Okay, okay. Uh, infirmary, you, I'm pretty sure you got some infection from when we were out there. Jeez, our morale's not looking good. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, the whole conflict thing. Of course, guys. Nice freaking going. Just had to start fighting. There's only so many of us right now. Let's get that going. I'm thinking, I'm thinking. I can't remove the infirmary. I'm thinking, guys. I'm thinking. Perfect. Let's boogie. Wow. Like, seriously? Okay, okay. Let's see what we can do to try and fix this morale again. Oh, boy. Desperate survivors. No. Alright, you are hella frustrated. Hmm. Is there anything that we can do? A plague heart. Eliminating a plague heart would do it. That would require us using a good amount of our explosives. Which we don't really want to do. Ah, <sighs> desperate times, guys. Desperate freaking times. We might actually just have to go and do it. Jeez, screw it. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. We're gonna have to figure out a way forward after this, though. It's in there. Let's go take care of this bad boy. Should take eight grenades. Or six grenades, and then two other... It's in that corner? All right. How would I get this, job again? this will have to hold us over for now. Fire in the hole! That sure left a mark. It's hurting! Don't let up now! Come on, come on, get rid of that weird stuff around you. There we go. That actually hurt a lot. Jesus Christ! Alright, we got attention all around us. Come on, kill him! Alright, that thing is actually taking its sweet time blowing up. There it goes. Perfect. That actually worked out very nicely. 
Except to you guys. Yeah, not doing that. Wow. It's like the game was doing so much it couldn't actually keep up with itself. What? Yeah, I'm definitely not dealing with the juggernaut. That's a no-no. Oh, jeez. I can feel his footsteps. Oh, boy. Alright, let's uh, not do that. Maybe find something a bit more useful in here. We'll have to eliminate these guys first. No. He can't fit in here, can he? Okay, okay, okay. Uh, gas, meds, gas, shoddy, um, stim. And maybe a lighter backpack? Yeah. Seriously? That's so annoying. Um, drop that for now. And drop the backpack. Drop, go to the backpack and drop the goddamn backpack. There we go. Jeez. Take the whistling box mine. Open the heart. Can't take anything more. That's okay. Uh, I don't know if he's still out there, but let's just make a nice quick exit here. And carry on with our business. Where's our car? Wait, what? Why are you cl- No! No! Jeez, we're not doing this. As much as I'm a glutton for punishment, we're not doing that. I might even have to end up using one of those stims. I'll use a snack, screw it. We're gonna have to use that uh, emergency care too. Okay, no sheds around, but we can't secure the place with a play card close by. I don't want to be near that bloater when it pops. Come on, sweetheart. Ugh, too much time. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, slightly smooth. Could have been smoother, but you know what? We're still alive. Uh, we got rid of that stupid frustration, regrettably, but not regrettably. God damn, man, we've got to make some changes at home quick. Is that latrine up already? Like, jeez. And uh, that's why I'm really not a fan of whistling box mines. They take forever and just draw in way too much attention. Or way more than you would like. So I just decided to use the opportunity to get rid of him. We're going to have to start figuring out our new base soon. But we're going to need more people. At least one more person. Ideally with computers. New infestation. That means this one's probably... Nope, not grown yet. We're going to have to start getting rid of him though. Oh wait, that's for... Oh, why do we have to go so far? You know what, you're gonna help me with this infestation, man, because this is ridiculous. Okay, let's fill her up first. Okay, we still got the crossbow, good. Still got Molotovs, good. Whoa, I didn't even know they can come out like that. Note to self, uh, drop the heavier stuff first. Okay, I don't have time for this. Alright, awesome. That's taken care of. Let's go drop this stuff off and get some emergency medicine, because I don't want to running around with these injuries. Come on, man. Let's go. We'll eventually have to call Red Talon, get ourselves that Red Talon workshop. Hey, uh, Greybeard, anyone in 
You guys are getting to be a little ridiculous. I want to disband you. You just keep on asking me for stuff. I do kind of want to see what they're like as allies. <laughs> that was too close. Whoa. That's not acceptable. What? <sighs> okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Hey, we'll talk to those stupid remnants who just want to keep on asking us for stuff. And I swear, man, if their, like, um, boost thing is not, like, for XP or food or something, I don't know. If it's not cool, then I don't care. I'm just going to give them up. Or I'll try and uh, disband them with our crappy influence. We still have to drop by the bounty broker, though. Still don't have a 50 cal. <laughs> Go there. We're going to check on their skills. Neither of them have computers, or if at least one of them have an open skill, or an open whatever you call it. You know, cool. We can deal with that. Just hopefully none of them are complete idiots and have, like, one of those skill caps where they like, have, like, only two stars in shooting or cardio because, I don't know, they suffered as a as a kid with a heart problem or something. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, here. Take the goddamn meds I, um, I risked my neck for. Okay, roadside assistance. Now, pr wait. Oh, wait a second. Hold up. Hold up. Now, these guys that I'm trying to help out now... Ooh, you guys got food, too. Let me learn about you, man. Driving. Okay, you've got open skills, and you're not a complete idiot, so you are now... You know, yeah. Okay, and you've got pathology. I don't think we're going to be needing that. Alright, homeboy. Looks like you were the best one for the job. Let's first buy the med rucksack. Can you Zeds, please just never mind? Uh, we're gonna buy the med, uh, the food rucksack because we kind of need it actually. And then we're going to search this place. Nah, we don't need to search it. Uh, now we're going to recruit you, correct? And we're gonna give you our computer's textbook because I think these other guys are gonna automatically give us roadside assistance once we become allies with them, provided we don't screw up their last mission. Okay. Recruit. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. All right. So, dude, now we're gonna take care of your mission. We're gonna take a pit stop at that guy. Even though it wouldn't really matter right now, we don't actually have to take a pit stop really would not matter right now. We have one Molotov. Let's not squander it. Oh, jeez, are you serious, dude? I didn't see that as part of the infestation. Okay, I'm like in Glitchtown. Why is it... Wait, that's not good. I'm like all jumpy. Again. Yes, you can, sweetheart. You got this. We got Stim. Nice, nice, nice. And surprisingly, they didn't hear all of that. I'm surprised you couldn't do anything about it with your amazing AI aim. But that's okay. That's okay. Gotcha. Okay, one last Molotov. Don't want to. Because crossbows are getting less and less relevant. Oh, come on! Alright, fine. Jeez. There we go. Good stuff. Alright, yeah, this will be the spot that they're gonna do it. We're gonna need more of those Molotovs. What is that? Oh, thought I was hearing a feral or something. All right. Thanks. I appreciate it. Hasta la vista. You know I help too, right? Hello? All right, guys, we're getting closer, man, and we've barely got the things we need. Yeah, that sounds about right. Yeah, we're not even close enough to get that freaking thing, man. All right, we're going to have to 
Oh, now that thing kicks in. <laughs> oh my gosh, man. We're getting dangerously close to that power on mission and we're barely prepared. All right. Let us call in our stuff. You want to do some business? How about sending someone over? Of course. We always have time to support our valued allies. Prestige trader. Where are you? Close to home? All right, sure. We're on our way. 